Hey everybody, Andy Stickle here. Welcome to the Law Firm Marketing Hacks podcast. In this episode, I'm going to tell you about my $50,000 per year annual expense. You're not just a lawyer, you're a defender of the defenseless. You possess a license that allows you to fight for those who can't fight for themselves. But while you're fighting for others, who's watching out for you? For far too long, lawyers have been fed line after line by big marketing companies, promising the world and delivering nothing. And even worse, think of all the people you were unable to help just because they didn't know you existed. That ends today. It's time to take the power back. This podcast will teach you how law firm marketing really works, how to not only get more clients, but how to get your dream clients, how to save time, how to save money, how to save energy by only focusing on tactics that work so you can grow your firm and help more people, and how to never get screwed by a marketing company ever again. My name is Andy Stickle, and I've helped thousands of lawyers, and I can help you too. This is the Law Firm Marketing Hacks Podcast. Okay, so every year in the course of running my business, there's a lot of different things that I spend money on. Um, Obviously, there's the the most important administrative cost of running my business. Um, You know, so I've got to pay for overhead and I've got to pay for my employees and salaries and all that stuff. And then... There's obviously the cost of fulfilling client campaigns. We do search engine optimization. We do social media. We do Facebook. We do YouTube. We do pay-per-click. We do all these different things, website design, content creation. All these different things cost money, and I'm paying all these different people all this money to fulfill all of these services. So I have one expense, though, that I don't really tell a lot of people about, um, and uh, I spent $50,000 this year already on it. Um, last year I spent $30,000 on this one expense and next year I'm going to spend probably a hundred thousand dollars on this one expense. And I would imagine that I will spend, uh, I'll have this expense in my business every single year until I retire, which God knows when that's going to happen. And that expense is coaching. And the reason that I am so good at marketing is because I learned how to do marketing from people who are really good at marketing. And, you know, it's like, I, I, and that's, this is how I've been my entire life. I've always wanted to learn how to do, I mean, I've always been ambitious. I've always wanted to learn how to, how to do things. So my, my philosophy, if I want to learn how to do anything in life, what I do is I go and find I figure out who's the best person out there. Who, who's one of the, who, you know, who, who's, who's doing exactly what I want to do. Who's absolutely crushing it. And how do I get in touch with them? And how do I get them to teach me what they know? And what this does is it saves me years and years and years of trying to figure it out on my own and, you know, failed experiments and reading tons of books. And I I do read books, but I don't read as many books as I would like to. But, you know, what this does is this shortcuts the path for me. I, 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 I've really like spent a lot of money on coaches, but what I've done is I've, I've shortcutted, I've, 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 I've cut years off the amount of time that it would have taken me to learn a lot of what I know on my own. And it's just because I figure out who are the best people that are already doing what I want to do and how do I get in front of them? And you know what? People that are successful, um, a lot of them don't work for free. (laughs) So, um, you know, they have courses, they have mastermind groups, they have all types of stuff. And I pay, I pay a lot of money. I pay, you know, my, my, my one business coach, I pay him $30,000 a year every February. I have to go to the bank and I have to wire $30,000 cash to his bank account. Um, you know, I've, I've, I go, I do so many different, I go to conferences. Um, I do, uh, there's something called funnel hackathon, um, that click funnels used to put on. It was put on by, uh, Russell Brunson, who I'm a huge fan of, who he does the same thing. What he does is he's in a bunch of different masterminds, um, and, and coaching programs. And then he goes and he teaches other people what he learns or what he's learned. So I spent $15,000 just to go to uh, Boise 
uh, not long ago, uh, and, and train with him for, for three days. Um, you know, I, I, I do tons of coaching program. I'm, I'm about to take a, a $5,000 sales coaching program just because, you know, it's like I could try to figure this stuff out on my own, or I could just pay somebody that already knows what they're doing and let them teach me. You know, you can, you can bypass years and years and years of testing and research and save, you know, it's like I spent $30,000, right? But how much money would I have wasted and how much time would I have wasted by trying to figure it out on my own and doing all these failed experiments and all these different things? I'm not saying everything I would do would fail, but you know, it's like when there's somebody that's proven in the market that already is doing exactly what you want and is kind of the category king, then it's worth, in my opinion, it's worth the time and it's worth, it's worth the money to bypass everything and just hear what they have to say and let them coach you one-on-one. So that's why I dedicate such a, such a large amount of money every single year to coaching because I know ultimately it's not an expense. You know, I call it an expense, but it's actually an investment in myself because every year using the information that I learn from the people that I pay this money to, I have already, I've, I've always made at least 10 times the amount of money that I spent on the coaching using the tactics that they taught me. So it's an investment. It's learning new things. It's getting better at my craft. And I I highly suggest that you do the same thing. You know, if you want to be a better lawyer, if you want to be a better entrepreneur, if you want to be a better marketer, if you want to improve yourself in any way, like books are great. um, Conferences are great. But coaching is, is, is probably my favorite way to learn is when you actually find somebody that's doing what you want to do and, you just say, all right, skip the BS, show me what works. And, and if you get the right coach, it will absolutely change your, change your world. That's why, that's why, you know, I, I do that. And I, I, I do coaching myself. I'm, I'm in masterminds. And then I also have a coaching program where I teach lawyers how to do their own marketing. And there's a lot of people that pay me a, what I think is a very reasonable amount of money, uh, for what they learn. Um, and eventually that price is going to go way up, but, um, you know, that, that, that's probably my biggest expense. And I've got a couple other masterminds that, you know, as I, as I uh, apply this stuff, I make more money every year. And as I make more money every year, I start wanting to learn more and more and more about this whole marketing thing, because it's just absolutely intriguing. I want to learn more about sales. I want to learn more about marketing. I want to learn about all this stuff. And I can spend the time, which I don't have, or I can spend the money And I can get in front of somebody and I can join somebody who is already successful and I can have them show me the way. And that's, that's what, that's what my $50,000 per year. And I've got $50,000 budgeted for it this year. Next year, I'm expecting to have about a hundred thousand dollars budgeted in coaching and, and conferences and all that type of stuff. But mostly the majority of that money, probably 90% of it, probably 90 of that hundred thousand dollars is going into coaching because it is so absolutely effective and, uh, you know, if I spend a hundred thousand dollars next year, I hope that I will still, uh, keep up with my, uh, 10 X ROI and, uh, this whole thing be worth it. So that's my, uh, kind of my thought for today. Make sure you, 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 you know, figure out who's the category King of, of what you want to do. And, you know, there's always something you can learn from, from other people. That's one of the, the, the worst mistakes you can make is, is thinking that, you know, everything. Um, I, you know, I learn, I, I learn, I, I, I listen to everybody. I, 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 I am, I'm like a sponge. I listen to everything and, you know, stuff that makes sense. I'll, I'll try it. Uh, other stuff, you know, not, not everything that, that people tell me works, but I mean, look, you, you can learn something from everybody, especially the top guys in your industry that are doing exactly what you want to do. Just save the time, pay the money, let them show you how to do it. Talk to you guys soon. Hey, thanks for listening to the Law Firm Marketing Hacks podcast. Remember to subscribe and leave a review. Do you want to know how to get more clients flocking to your firm today? Do you want the phone ringing off the hook with more potential leads? Well, I'm a big fan of getting leads from multiple sources. You never want to put all your eggs in one basket. And one method that we use for our clients is getting them ranked in Google. The firms that rank in the top three on Google in the map section get more leads, get more clients, and make more money than the other firms. It's just plain and simple. It's a fact. But how do you get there? There's so much information out there. How do you start? Where do you start? Well, to address this concern, I created a free 24-part video series that's designed to help you skyrocket your firm to the top of the Google rankings. It's 
24 videos over my shoulder where I teach you exactly how to get your firm to the top of the Google Maps. And I don't even, it's not just theory. I actually show you my computer screen and I say click here and type here and optimize this and do this. I, I tell you everything you need to know in this 24 part video series. This course teaches you exactly how to improve your firm's Google ranking. So to get a free copy of this course, this 24 part video series shipped to you on USB, I'll ship it right to your door. Go to heylawyers.com. That's H E Y L A W Y E R S. Dot com. The simple steps that you'll learn in this course will lead to more clients and more revenues really fast. And you don't need to be tech savvy. I show you everything you need to do in very, very simple terms. So go to heylawyers.com today and get a free guide, a free USB drive that's going to show you how to dominate Google. So you need to hurry though because we're almost out of these USB drives and once they're gone, they're gone. So make sure to get yours today. Thanks again for listening, and I'll see you next time on the Law Firm Marketing Hacks podcast.